Well, folks, it's over. The game is over. The long drive is over. I don't know where to go anymore. The road is done. This is actually kind of a scary moment. Um, also, you guys were really sad. I'm going to flash some of those comments up on screen. So, yeah, what do we do now? Look, the AI are still spawning. They're not going this way, though. Like, what is beyond the great unknown? Is it something that we should just continue? Uh, do I see any stops near? Wait. There's a house over there. Uh, looks like there could be a diner or something that way. Man, it's like one of those things where you're just kind of sad and you just don't know what to do. You've done this for like the past year and a half at least on this particular save. And you know what? We're going to keep doing this. We're going to go to the great unknown and see what we can actually run into. And you never know, maybe the road will reappear and I'll have actually a meaning to life. Uh, because, you know, we've always just followed our paths here and... All of a sudden the path is gone. I feel like there's some sort of like actual deep meaning to this where it's like, oh yeah, you know, you don't have to follow the path of life here. Even though it, I like the path of life, it's kind of, it, it makes me feel safe. I know where I'm going. Now I'm just walking into the great unknown. Wait, does this mean I don't get to see any more Carl's or any of the AI? You know, okay, I'll tell you what. We're gonna go out a ways. And then we're gonna come back to this road. I could always drive back home. I mean, that's an option too. But I'm just kind of curious if anything appears out here. I'm probably gonna get bored of the outside the road life really quick and I'm gonna wanna go back. This is fine. Also, you guys should totally hit that thumbs up button. Um, it's gonna take me ages to walk to anything. Okay, this sucks. We're going back. Okay, we're going back to the road. Look! It's Carrot! Carrot spawned in! Even Carrot's turning around. He's like, no, Komodo, don't go that way. There's nothing over there. Uh, you know what? This is fine. Also, the AI are, like, spawning like crazy at the end of the road. That must represent something. They keep spawning in the same spot, and they're all driving back that way. They know not to go this way. I don't know. I think it's a symbol. It's some sort of thing. Wait. Look, even the bus is gonna turn around. They're all turning around. Also, it's getting dark and I'm scared. And there's no lights on the road. Uh, hey, Mr. Bunny. Um, about no, no. Okay, we need Mr. Bus Driver. I'd like to. I would like a ride back, please. Uh, oh no, <laughs> this is bad. No, they're trying to kill me at the end of the road. It took me forever to get here. The bus looks like it's stuck. Okay, this. Is, wait, do I have a weapon on me? Uh, I've got a brush. Can I throw this at you? Uh, I think he's getting bored of me. Okay, this is fine. Um, I mean, we could go off the road, but I need to find a car. Uh, because, yeah, I ended up with no car last episode because I'm stupid. I don't know how parking brakes work. So, I just now realized something. A lot of people will probably say, Komodo, why don't you just jump in the AI's car and let him take you back? They spawn in now this way, but the further up the road you walk, the further away or they have to turn around so it's like they don't even come back this way i'm so confused right now like i need a car really bad because everything that we're doing doesn't make sense like the ai don't seem to spawn they spawn this way they go that way and turn around uh it's very rare they continue up see look they spawn backwards it's just not working uh it's honestly kind of annoying <laughs> It's bad because you don't know how to play the game anymore. You're so used to the game running one way. So it's like when you run the opposite way, everything comes uh, or becomes discombobulated. And uh, yeah, it's, it's ultimately really, really confusing. And is there? Okay, wait. Is somebody actually coming this way? Hey, can I get a ride? Can I get? Well, I can see the AI are still up to their same shenanigans. Uh, he's trying to pull over the other one. Hey, can you come back? I, I really would love a ride. Uh, come on, buddy. I need something here. G give me something. Throw me a bone. Do something for me. Nope. Oh, they are gone. This is weird. Like, should we go back? Or should... You gotta be kidding me. Um, this is not the time, UFO. I've had a bad day. Okay, you can go away. I don't have time for this. I, I got stuff to do. Okay, it's daylight again. Uh, I wandered off the path because I remembered that like the past uh, I don't know how many I guess several kilometers I haven't been able to find like any sort of stops along the road So we got to take our chances here and hope that <gasps> Ooh, It's beautiful. Please tell me you have an engine. Yes That's an engine. 
fuel okay no oil i better find oil around here does it have fuel wait where do i fuel this one at oh it's in the back uh that's empty okay this isn't hopeless there's a barrel over there maybe we can find some fuel you know i'm gonna carve my own path here i'm not going back at least not right now i feel like maybe we should journey out beyond the road uh where the ai isn't we'll go back to the end of the road and we'll drive just straight off of it and we'll just see where we end up also there is totally a car spawn in here that is amazing i wonder if it's got fuel all right well let me prep this vehicle real quick and uh let's hope we can find enough stuff to make this bad boy run also that is a pointy shifter okay we got a problem i was able to salvage stuff uh i don't have coolant though uh oh, oh come on come on no no why is my stream oh okay my stream is weak um how much do we oh we got 0.1 in there why do wait why do i have gas in my system that was empty that's weird i'm peeing gas right now um yeah it's a bit of a problem i can get out maybe to the desert biome and hit some cacti uh we really okay i'm gonna search again i, I feel like there's got to be a little bit of water somewhere wait did the toilets hold water that might be a thing uh here mount that on there water in here uh no that's not a thing we just sit on it by the way we have a lot of gas here uh i'm gonna be able to completely fill it up but it ain't gonna matter i can't put alcohol in there uh no uh anything along the side of the building oh there's a well over here uh yeah i don't want to get stuck in one of these uh yeah well, let's not even play with that uh i could drink liquid but i think if i drink it it's just gonna go right through me well, this is gonna be risky biscuits, but we don't really have an option. I mean, this is basically, actually this should be a full tank of gas. Like this is the vehicle we have been dealt with by the game for now. So yeah, I don't have an option. I just need to find either cacti or a building that actually has a faucet in it, which I don't think this one does. Uh, I didn't see one at least. Okay, I need this vehicle to be pushed over. Uh, is there anything in here? I didn't even think about that. Uh, I can dismount this. Is there... Oh, and there's liquid in here. What is it? <gasps> okay, it's water, oil, and alcohol. I feel like this might work better uh, than what we have in there. Plus, it's a little bit more efficient one. I believe this one's rusty, right? Uh, yeah, it is. Okay, well, I mean, we got something going for us. I think we should be able to make it at least a little ways with this thankfully we had that awkwardly spawned car in there all right well you know what fresh slate here let's uh see if it cranks yep cranks runs all right let's head back to the road and then we're gonna drive back to the end and we're just gonna go off like we're gonna risk it for the biscuits uh, i might never see the road again i might never see carl in them again i mean i could save at the end of the road which i'm probably gonna do and then go off the end that way if there's just nothing out there i can always turn around and go home so let me know what you guys think about that okay so here it is this is my end of the road right here all right adjust our mirrors we gotta pay attention the off-roading is not the best thing in the game but we don't have an option here so we're gonna drive straight off it and then i guess we're going up that mountain back there uh, maybe there's something on the other side of it. I mean, it's probably more procedurally generated land. Also, wait, why is this got a ramp on it? Wait, what? You know, that's... Oh, dear. This is how my journey is... <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. Uh, you know, I've seen this before. So, normally, I actually had to go watch a couple people finish the game. They had this weird, like, ramp thing off the end. Mine didn't appear. Like, and if I reload the game, that's not there anymore. I need to reload this save. I'm not going to get all those parts back. Okay, we need to drive easy off the end of the road and then to the big mountain. Okay, let's start that magnificent journey once again, this time to the side of the road because I don't want to launch off it. It's weird that it just now loaded the little cap thing. Which, I'm waiting to come back through here and, you know, mom's house be here like I was promised. Um, well, whatever that might be. Oh, my road hasn't loaded over. Oh, there it is. Yep, that's just straight up a ramp. All right, well, I guess let's just go. We're going for it. We're doing it. Uh, no more car Wait, actually, it would be kind of creepy if somehow Carl, Carrot, or whatever would actually spawn out here. I'm going to miss those two, or three. Well, Carla didn't appear anymore, but still, I'm going to miss those. 
I mean, we'll eventually see him again if we go back to the road. But this is an exciting new adventure. Like, I wonder if my car could even make it up that mountain. Also, that mountain looks so far away. Like, it's like it's right there and you could touch it. But I guarantee you, it's going to take a while for us to actually get over there. I got headlights, right? Okay, I do. Yeah, we're going to need those. We're no longer going to have the light and the guide from the road, which is kind of scary, to be honest with you. Whoa, okay, so the grass biome just reappeared. Uh, great, now I can't see rocks. I mean, you can see some. I think there's still some low ones in here. Uh, this is weird. Like, I don't have any AI to interact with. Like, we're really just going to see if there's some stops out there. Uh, I see a... Oh, there's still rabbits. Uh, I see, of course, a oil tanker ahead of us, and there's a couple other stops, maybe a tower stop. Uh, that mountain's also getting bigger. Like, it looks steeper uh, the closer we get, which is kind of scary. Uh, uh oh, 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 um, that's embarrassing. So I may or may not have been looking at my phone in real life because now that I'm driving in an open field, it's not quite as entertaining. Uh, the engine fell out. That's uh, normally a good sign. It's, oh, this is fine. Uh, just grab that bad boy, slip it back in. And what if it were this easy to actually, uh, I guess, fix your car after you destroy it? Like, you just pop the parts back on, and you're good to go. Uh, so we lost a door. Okay, Komodo, you've got to pay attention. Uh, onward and upward. Uh, stop staring at your phone in real life. This is fine. You know, I can't tell you, like, how much I look at my phone while playing this game, because a lot of it is just driving. Like, you can't commentate over the whole thing why am i not what the okay that's really okay there it goes just took it a second like it didn't go and then i put it back and or put the handbrake back on and yeah that was kind of awkward all right uh keep going let's go this way yeah i'm assuming it's gonna get dark soon you know what'd be crazy what if we did run back into a road like i always thought what if you just went like it'd be so funny like a kilometer or a couple kilometers from the end of the road and then you run back into your house like it was just one giant loop and if you went the opposite direction you would get to the end of the road that would be hilarious like i feel like that's how this should end uh but that's just my opinion all right we're starting our climb up the mountains past the first tanker this is so weird like i know we've driven off oh look there's a tower stop right here nice i want to get to the peak of this mountain before the end of the episode that way we could just look over the edge and see what it is. Like, what if it just fell off into the unknown and maybe the game stopped doing the procedural generation of the land, uh, if that makes any sense. I'm going to drive under this real quick to see if any vehicles spawn in. Uh, uh, so, where do UFOs go? What the? Uh, so, when the game doesn't have a road to spawn... A vehicle it spawns it on top of the tower this is strange what the heck okay also does this tower seem low no i don't think it's low uh yeah that's a thing all right let's keep driving yeah i just spawned the bus right up up top i've never seen that before also there was a ladder up there i might could have used that all right uh the peak looks like it's coming up we might have to go to sleep that way we can actually uh see it during the day is there wait where are the lights uh, up, up, click, click. There it is. Okay, so we're back today. We're almost to the summit of the mountain. You can see it. There actually is a stop over here I want to take a peek at real quick. Just to see if there's something here. But yeah, it just gets so tall out here. Uh, it's rather impressive. I, also, I don't... It's scary that I don't see the road anymore. Like, I don't know if I could even navigate back. I think it's that way, but... I don't know what my chances would be of actually hitting it. Alright, so... What do we got here? Why are they spawning all the cars on top of the roof now? Like, look, that one's on the roof too. Also, it's weird. This building's aimed this way, which technically the road would be back that. I don't know. I'm confusing myself now. All right. Uh, let's see if there's anything in here. Hello? Uh, any secrets and goodies? Uh, there's dead body parts and stuff in here. Um, yeah, nothing I really want to stop for yet. I mean, I could search it out. Eventually, maybe we do need to gather survival supplies, but... That's not the goal here. There's so many stops. Once you get out in the middle of nowhere, like the stops seem to be a lot closer together, which is weird. Uh, so I don't think we'll have a supply issue. There's a side. Is that a gravestone? Yeah, there's a gravestone out there. All right, let's keep moving forward here. All right, folks. Uh, we're at the summit of what appears to be the biggest mountain uh, that I've been able to find. Uh, for reference, 
Uh, the oil tanker, which you can not even see it. It's way back there. That's where we came from. So we've actually driven a long ways. Like, I've been recording for probably about an hour now just driving. Also, apparently the uh, mixture of coolant is really working. But we are about to go over the top here. We're going to see what is on the... Uh, well, I keep saying we're coming up to the summit. It keeps expanding and going up. Either there's going to be a massive drop-off on the other side and we're going to fly down the mountain, which might be amazing. Or maybe there's nothing. I mean, that would be kind of cool, too. I, it keeps getting bigger. Stop it. Look. It's going right back up. Okay, we've got, like, at least another five more minutes of driving. Uh, I hyped all that up just to be disappointed that we still had a ways to go. Uh, we are in a snow biome, though. That's kind of cool. As I was saying, the summit of the mountain. This, this is it, right? Okay, we are about to cross over into the unknown. What is going to be on the other side? Don't tell me this goes higher. No, okay, this is definitely it. This is the end. We're in a snow biome. What is on the other side of this? Uh, wait. It really flattens out? Huh? Does it? The world's endless. Like, it just keeps going. We made it to the top, and look, there's more mountains, and there's clouds. There's more stops. Like, the game doesn't actually end. Oh, do we see any roads or any? Nope. This is what happens when you don't look at the road as you're driving. Okay, let's get to the other side of this real quick. I just want to look down in this valley. Uh, make sure there isn't something that we haven't seen before. Uh, maybe mom's house is just relocated and it's over here. Nope. I feel like it just it just keeps going. The game just doesn't stop. Like, there's another really tall mountain. Like, we're going to go down in this valley. Uh, no roads. Just emptiness with the occasional stop. Well, folks, I think we've about answered it. Like, I think, honestly, if we do continue the series, we've got to go back. Like, make it our point, or make it a point to go back and finally get back to our house. Like, I feel like it needs to be a thing. Also, we're just going backwards right now. This is fine. Hopefully, we'll get some new mods here soon. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time. We died.